Hi there. You just got back from your family reunion and you took a lot of great pictures, but your cousin forgot his camera and said, can you burn a copy of all your pictures onto a CD? And you said, sure. Well, unfortunately, you had no clue how to burn the pictures onto a CD or any data files for that matter. So here's how you do it. I just placed a blank CD into the CD drive of my laptop. You can use it on a regular PC. And these choices pop up on the screen. We're going to burn files to disk. Once you've clicked on this, let's give it a name. Let's call it uh, Photos. You have a couple choices here. You could use it like a USB flash drive. That will allow you to use the same disk over and over again, but you're only going to be able to use it in this particular PC. So we're not going to use that. You want to give this CD away to the cousin, so you're going to select with a CD DVD player. And let's hit next. You want to drag the files to this folder and add them to this particular disk. What I'll probably do is go down here, right click, open Windows Explorer. Let's go to pictures. And let's see the ones from, uh, we're going to use ones called demo photos right here. Now I could just drag the entire folder over there, but let's open up the pictures themselves. And in here, I'm going to hit Control A. That selects all of them. I might want to deselect one of them. You could do that with holding down the Control key and clicking on that. And you'll notice all the rest are still highlighted in light blue. Click on any one of them, drag it over, and all 36 pictures in this particular file are now transferred over there. You see a message down on the bottom says you have files waiting to burn to disk. Let's shut this down. I could add more files. They don't have to be pictures. They could be data files. Now we're going to burn to disk. Prepare the disk. Recording speed, just leave that alone. Close the wizard after the files have been burned. And hit next. I'll speed up the process here a little bit to save time showing it to you. We're done. The disk ejected. I'm going to go ahead and pop the disk back in. Let the system read it and we'll confirm that those pictures are indeed on that disk. This dialog box has popped open. Open folder to view files. And you notice all the pictures are on there. And we are on that particular drive, the DVD drive. You can see it up here as well. So we were successful bringing them up in here. And that's all there is to it.